Hey guys, it's Zapsy. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm super excited to have you join me in this tutorial. And in this one, I want to show you seven awesome Chrome extensions that will help you clone website literally for free. They will make your work a lot easier. These uh, Chrome extensions have several functionalities. Some that will help you clone the website. Some will help you clone all the text. Some will help you clone some functionalities on the web that will help you become better. So without further ado, I think as you walk you through these Chrome extensions, they are tools that I use from day to day. I just feel like I can share them with you so that you can see which one of them might just be a lifesaver for you. So without further ado, I think we should go straight into my computer. Let me show you these Chrome extensions. So right on my screen here is the first Chrome extension. It's called Save All Resources. Uh, you can just go to your Chrome extension and just type Save All Resources. You should be able to add this to your Chrome extension. I already added this to my Chrome extension. What this would do is that it will literally help you save uh, the front end resources of every website you want to clone. It doesn't work on your uh, Chrome extension toolbars uh, like others. Uh, if you go to any web page, for example, I have WordPress.org here, you can just literally uh, right click that page and you can come to your inspect tool. Just open up all the resources you have. You should be able to see resource saver here. So if you click this, it will launch this Chrome extension. And from here, you can see that you can easily just hit this button, save all resources. You can see it will just uh, save every front end resource of this website. So basically, in my opinion, this is my number one tool that I recommend for you to check out. It's called Resources Saver. Uh, the second one on my list here is called Zip the Web uh, Website Copy and Downloader. Uh, you can easily uh, search for it as well and download this into your Chrome extension. You'll be able to use this tool. But this tool is not really a good to tool. I really don't use it. The reason why I don't use it is because it's not free speed. Basically, not necessarily because I can't use this for free, but just because before I use it, it will be requiring me to get some API connection. Uh, so, for example, if I really want to use this on this website too as well, I think I should just close this up. Uh, let's just uh, look for the Chrome extension. Uh, Zip Web. Uh, so, you can see here, for me to be able to use it, it's asking for some API keys. And then I need to uh, maybe just put the website URL I want to clone here. And if I want to get this API key, it's very simple. If I click this, it will take me to a page where I can get uh, this API key uh, with Rapid API. You should be able to get the keys. Rapid API is a fantastic place where you can get access to several API connections. Uh, you can get some basically for free and some paid. Uh, actually, this one, you are able to use it literally for free. But again, you would require to present your card. Uh, you can maybe check this tool out, but basically I really don't uh, use this. But that's the reason why uh, it's making my list because it's a fantastic tool. It does the job too as well, but personally, I just don't like trying to test a tool and I will uh, be using or have to add my credit card. Basically, I think that's it uh, for this. Uh, the next tool here for me is called Web Content Copier. Is another fantastic tool, but this does something entirely different. This is not going to copy the entire website design for you, but this would help you copy the text on the website. And this is quite very, very useful for you if you're using ChatGPT or you are trying to possibly just analyze the content of a website. If you're doing SEO, uh, let's just say you want to outrank a blog or you want to analyze the headings, the headers on a particular page or a blog, you can use this tool literally. It's fantastic. So uh, it's called Web Content Copier. You can have this, like I said earlier. So if I come to my page again here, let me search for the Chrome extension. So it's here, it's called Web Content Copier. If I launch this, so you can see, I can just literally copy the content of this page by just clicking this uh, button here. And that's literally everything I need to do. So if I just go to my uh, notepad or go to ChatGPT, uh, I just can test that here. So you can see everything here on this page has been copied here. So you can see the text here. 
Uh, it's just fantastic. I can copy all the text and I can analyze the uh, content. And I think it's a fantastic, fantastic tool. Uh, my next tool here is called Web Page Downloader. This is another fantastic free Chrome extension that you can use to download any website uh, for offline viewing into your PC. And I think it's another fantastic one. Uh, so let's just come here to this tool here too as well. I can just uh, launch uh, the Chrome extension. It's called Web Page Downloader. So if I launch it up, you can see everything you're able to do. You're able to download HTML, the images. You can also download uh, links. You can download the asset, which is the CSS, the JS. You can download document, uh, PDF, doc, everything on that particular page. You can also download the content as text. So you can see what this other uh, Chrome extension is able to do for you. This one is including it in the list of what it's able to do. You can also download uh, a single HTML file if you just want to download a single page and not the entire page. And everything you need to do from here, you just hit the download button and it's going to crawl the entire page, the entire website and download it for you. And I think this is another fantastic chrome extension so you can see that is already downloading into my browser that's it so we can see here that we now have a download to our website and also we can see links to other download we can download other pages on the website here i think i made a mistake earlier by saying that this downloads the entire website no it downloads the entire resources on the page not the entire website ah sorry if i have misled you saying that i need to just and make that clarification. I think that's uh, quite very, very fantastic. So you can see that again, that uh, is beautiful. And the next thing on my list here is called Osito Copy Page Content. Uh, this is also fantastic, uh, helping you copy text on your website uh, for ChatGPT, or you can use it for prompt. And it's a fantastic, fantastic uh, Chrome extension too as well. So if you're into content and you want to easily copy content, and this also would work for you. So if I come back here as usual, let me launch another my Chrome extension. Uh, let's uh, bring out Osito. Where is it? Okay, so Osito is here. So I can open it up. And you can see here, you can copy text for ChatGPT, copy prompt for ChatGPT. You can come here, you can summarize the content, translate to Spanish, translate to English, generate questions, answer questions. Fantastic, fantastic stuff here. Super simple and easy thing to use so you just want to copy uh text uh for example or you can just easily just click here and then you can see this is copied you can take it chat gpt you can take it anywhere you already have all the text on that page copied literally and i think that's a fantastic tool to as well for you to check out uh if you are really into content uh, so let me just move into the next one here the next one here is called the magic DeepMagic is a paid Chrome extension. If you're familiar with my YouTube channel, I have done an in-depth tutorial walking you through DeepMagic in time past. So you can check that uh, video in the video description. It's a no-brainer that is a paid tool really because of what it does. So if you go to DeepMagicWebsite.com, uh, you should be able to see the list of everything that this is able to do. You can get the code of any element on the website. You can copy the media query of any element you're trying to copy. You can convert CSL to Tailwind CSS. You can copy code through iframes. Uh, it has the dev tool integrations to that help you copy front, hide, delete uh, content on an existing website. And I think maybe I should show you that. You can copy any component into React or JSX and also as a studio in, uh, integration that you can easily uh, put your code into and work on it. But I not really a fan of your uh, studio integration really i don't know if it has been updated from the last time i did check uh we can just go to any website basically and very simple you can uh install the chrome extension like i do right now so if you launch it you can see you can copy the full uh, page also have a drop down here for you to uh maybe select uh, the format of the component it could be html or gsx you can also select the style format, Tailwind CSS, inline, external CSS, local CSS. Or you can make this adaptable balance or exact. Fantastic stuff here. You can just 
a copy here you can uh, go to the settings and you can also launch your toolbox uh, you can see from the toolbox here a lot of things you can do you can copy uh, individual elements of a website you can also copy front uh, you can also copy front of that website you can uh, trash or hide some elements uh, in case you are just inspecting you checking things you can go to a website where you have element on each other you want to take out the element on the top so that you can have access to the one uh, beneath uh, that's a fantastic tool there yeah you may not know that you can also uh, add color picker you can also add some grid in case you want to analyze the structure of a page uh, also take a screenshot of that page and you can also have ruler for you to be able to rule to measure uh, get sizes fantastic stuff here i must tell you so for you to copy element if you come to this tool you can see you can easily just uh, click any element and copy that element take it to your project and paste it there you can even copy element here paste it into wordpress directly using maybe a page builder like elementor even the default gutenberg I use the HTML widget and paste the code here. You can copy website from here directly into WordPress, just like that. So I've done tutorials like that before too on this channel. I think that's beautiful. Uh, you can copy font, you can trash certain things. You might want to remove them completely or hide them. For example, you can just come to the page here. Let's say I want to hide this. You can see I can hide this here. I can hide anything on this page and I think this is super, super cool. So you can copy and experiment with this tool for yourself uh, that's just it i can refresh the page to have my element back just like that so my element is back this is fantastic here uh the next tool here that would make your life a lot better is called capture.me this is also different in a way i love this tool because it's able to help you capture certain elements on the page and help you and help you refresh them and it just make your life a lot better it's difficult for me to put what this tool uh, does in words maybe i should just show you real real quick let's see i'm interested in google conversion i can i want to know the current price of a uh, dollar to maybe my local currency exchange rate by time i can just see dollar to naira uh, dollar to naira today for example yeah you can see this is what our naira is to a dollar currently right now today so what i can do right now is to launch the chrome extension uh, so i can just come here i can set for capture.me so it's here and i can launch it uh, from here i can just take the snapshot for this i can just easily just uh, capture this like this and once I'm done, I can just say save this snapshot to my dashboard. So if you create an account, you should be able to add this to your dashboard like this. And that's it. So right now I have this here on my dashboard and I can go just in case again, I might want to know the current exchange rate of maybe Bitcoin to dollars or to my currency. I can also screenshot that. And the amazing thing is that this would keep refreshing to give you current updates per time. That's the craziest part of this tool. So you can see once there is a change in the conversion rate, I should be able to see that here on my dashboard in real time. That's crazy. It's a paid tool. You can try it out for free. I'm trying it for free right now, but this is what every money you invest into it so you can try this for seven days for free you can upgrade for you to see exactly what you can use this tool for but trust me uh, this tool is fantastic it is worth a checkout for you so you can just it just go around anything that's updating that you need to check in real time you can have 20 30 things you need to keep an eye on at the same time it's fantastic for you to be able to screenshot them and bring them into this tool and then you're able to just uh, see how all of these things unfold in real time i don't think i want to say more about this tool but you can check it out yourself and confirm to me in the uh, comment section if this is a fantastic tool or not so what do i have next here is another fantastic tool called html copy so what this would do is that it will help you copy the entire structure of a page you want to know the navigation, the header, the footer, the entire structure 
in case you want to design something similar and it's a fantastic tool you can go to any website as usual wordpress.org will do the magic for me here as well uh, go to the chrome extension and then just open html copy and then you can see here you can easily uh, copy this to clipboard you can copy these as an you can also export this as a file uh, so that maybe that will open up as a text file so that you can see all the structure of the page uh you can yeah, you can exclude certain elements you don't want to copy maybe the navigation bar the header the footer you can also exclude iframes if you don't want to do that or maybe script or maybe the head or images whatever it is you want to do and other things here you can maybe also add in case there's a pop-up on the page you want to exclude that certain things here uh, you can just easily copy this to your clipboard or just export this as a file so you can see here i have a txt file downloaded to my computer already i can easily open it up and then start analyzing the page fantastic tool there again if you ask me i close this up and then i can come to my browser and i have uh, this document here ready for me to consume and that's the summary of uh, my Chrome extension tools that I use to copy uh, content online. It's a fantastic, fantastic tool. Some of them are free, some of them are paid, but by and large, they are fantastic tools. You can check out. They may save you a lot of time of work. Uh, so that's my list. That's my tutorial. I believe it has been super helpful for. I believe it has been super helpful for you. If it has, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions you can let me know in the comment section i'll look out for them as usual i would see another tutorial subscribe so that you get notified when i keep uploading content i'll see you again stay safe